Goddess the Tempura. Freshly cooked. Hi everyone! When you are in the Philippines, there's one thing that should be at the top of your to-do list and that is visiting seafood restaurants. We are embarking on a mouth-watering journey. Welcome to Seascape Village in the heart of Pasay City. Oh look, the fish! What sets Seascape Village apart is the interactive dining experience. You pick your seafood from the market stalls and the restaurants cook it to your liking. Whether you prepared it grilled, steamed, or in a flavorful sauce, they've got you covered. We are in one of the stalls here in Seascape Village. We're gonna look what they have. Lobster! Hello guys! We are in the Seascape Village. This behind me. There are crabs, fish. So... Let's see here in Sharon and Lorna, Bisaya. Bisaya is a dialect in southern Philippines. I'm in paradise right now. Look at these seafoods here. I could see clams, scallops, mussels, um, squids, and what else? My God, everything is here. I'm so excited. Wow, we have we've got lots of seafood. So actually here you have to there's a lot of seafood shops around, fresh fish. You buy whatever you like and then you search for a restaurant where you can have them cooked. So let's see what we're having here. Eric, look at the fish here. Bam. That's your lapu-lapu. So we picked our fish. We take some squids, shells, and for sure, the seaweed's my favorite. Hi guys! We are in Sharon and Lorna, Bisaya. Mga Bisaya ni sila oh. They're giving discounts here. Ada lang ito biya sa akin. Say say natin ito. Ito ni A600. Oo. Tara wag kong piyot. Elista, Elista. These are the crabs, my favorite. Sharon and Lorna, Bisaya. So guys, we already bought all the seafoods that we want. We spent there about 4,200 pesos. Well, for the quantity of seafoods we took, the price is really, really good. But guys, actually, we bargained and we also got free seaweeds and clams. 
The staff there were so nice and really friendly. And now we are here in the Royal Kitchen restaurant to have all the seafoods cooked. How it works is that we have to tell them exactly how we wanted the seafoods to be cooked and they will charge us per kilo basis. Paano yan ang charge sa restaurant per kilo? Kahit anong luto per kilo. Adobo, butter, some garlic, so this is what so these are the dishes that they offer you can choose from here how you want your seafoods to be cooked now we're going to find our table and wait for our food to be served i'm sure it will take some time Actually, you could also order food straight from their menu if you don't want to go to the seafood stalls outside. And here's our halaan or clam soup. My favorite. Everything is my favorite, by the way. Oh my god, that's the tempura. Freshly cooked! I must say that they really cook the food so well and the staff are very nice and very friendly. By the way, there are many restaurants here in Seascape Village to choose from. This place is so huge, there are even live bands playing on weekends. It also offers a very nice view of Manila Bay Sunset. If you wish to know more information about this place, please check in the description below a link to their website. Now, you might be wondering how much we paid in the restaurant for the cooking, additional food, and the drinks. It's actually almost 9,000 pesos. So all in all, we paid a little bit more than 12,000 pesos for the entire dinner, which I find really reasonable for this quality of food. Another thing that I really like here in Royal Kitchen is that the place is so spacious and bright. 
And if you wish to dine in private, they also offer VIP rooms. We are so happy with the food. Definitely, we are coming back with the whole family. And we're back! Actually, guys, we made a reservation for 31 packs for the entire family. We actually went back to the same seafood stall, the Sharon and Lorna Bisaya. And this time, we paid almost 14,000 pesos. Okay, Ral. Hiwaon, ah, hiwaon na lang. Oo. Hiwaon na We actually decided to have the same dishes like before and added some few dishes. We are seated in three uh, separate huge round tables. The restaurant is really spacious. Although it is full, there were some VIP rooms also occupied, but it just doesn't feel it's crowded because uh, there's enough space and the place is bright. As expected, the food is really good. No complaints and everyone is happy. You might be wondering how much we paid this time with 31 pucks. Well, in the restaurant, it was 10K for the cooking, a little bit more than 10K pesos for the additional foods and drink, and in the seafood stall, it was 14,000 pesos. So all in all, it's 34,000 pesos. So you can calculate around 1,000 per box, which is really okay. Dining at Seafoods Restaurant in the Philippines is often affordable, even for travelers on a budget. You can savor actually a sumptuous seafood feast without burning a hole in your pocket. So, if you're a food lover in the area or planning a trip to Manila, Seascape Village is a must visit. It is located in Pasay City and it's easily accessible from various parts of Metro Manila. No, he's Thank you for joining me on this journey. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button for more travel and food explorations. See you in my next video. Bye!